Hello everyone. So previously we have seen how to install Python and PyCharm. So in this video we will try to install GitHub Copilot for our PyCharm. So go to the Google and just search for GitHub Copilot. Then go to the site and log in with your GitHub account. Make sure that you have a GitHub account. The moment you log in, just try to compare the plans. For individual, it is a $10 per month and per year, $100. And you will get uh, some free trial days. And then for the corporate, it is a $19 per user per month. All right. So just click on a start free trial and it will ask you to fill up the form using your credit card. The moment you successfully complete filling the form, then you can get the GitHub Copilot. What you need to do, go to the PyCharm and click on a file, go to the settings and go to the plugins and search for a GitHub Copilot. It is already installed on my machine and my PyCharm. What you can do, once you get the, this plugin, just try to install it. Once you install, you need to restart the PyCharm. So once you restart the PyCharm, then you just go to the tool and you will see GitHub Copilot over here as a menu option. Just go over there and click on login to GitHub. The moment you log in, the click on login to GitHub, it will give you some code. Just copy that code and the browser will be opened and just paste that code inside that. All right. Now, once you have successfully got the GitHub Copilot, how to verify them? Just open any file, a Python file, say for example, main.py, and just try to write in a comment, create a hello world API. And if you get any intelligence, or I can also try and see you are getting the intelligence. It means your GitHub Copilot has been successfully installed and you are start working with the help of GitHub Copilot. So that's it for this video. And if you face any difficulty, just tell me in the comment section or send me a message. I'll help you out. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.